Hello and welcome. This is Angie with the CountrySheetCottage.net here today with another edition of Cricut Basics. So we've been tackling how to use SVG files. So we've already covered it, how to use them on like iPad, iPhone, iOS devices. And we've also covered it on how to use them on a computer. So today's edition is how to use those SVG files on Android. So if you're using the Android app on any Android device, this should help you learn how to use those SVG files. So we share SVG files all the time. So let me show you how I share them and how I use them on Android devices. So the first thing you should do is to get your SVG file. In this case, it was emailed to me. So I would just click here to download to add it to my device. Then once it's downloaded, you would go to My Files on your Android device. And you would need to find the zip. So I'm going to find the zip and I'm going to open it up. And I'm going to uncheck everything and I'm only going to have the SVG highlighted and I'm gonna and this unzipped it into a folder so it's in a folder called fireworks and it's inside that folder but I want it just in downloads so I'm going to move it so I'm gonna hold my hand on finger on it until it's highlighted and then I'm going to move and I am going to pick just download and done. then once that's complete it's just in the download folder and I can open up Cricut Design Space. I find it easier to unzip it than move it out so I can find it more easily. So we're going to start a new project and then we're going to click upload across the bottom. Pick select from photo library and then we want to pull down up here at the top and we want to pick whatever device you're on. Instead of picking download, pick the device you're on then pick download. Then you can scroll through and find that file that you just put out there. So it would be a .svg file, it would not be a zip, so you want to pick that. And then here we can name it whatever we want. So we would name it whatever we want and then click save to save that file. Now it's in our uploaded images and we can pick it and insert it onto the canvas. From there we can resize it or do whatever we want to with it and cut it out of whatever material we like. So that's pretty simple. And then you can use SVG files either from the CountrySheetCottage.net or any other source on the internet directly on your Android app. So if you want to get the free SVG files that I share on the CountrySheetCottage.net, look for a link in the description for this video. Have another type of device, iPod, iPhone, iPad, computer that you want to use an SVG file on. Look for links in the description for this video for all of those on how to use SVG. And you can also find a link to the Cricut Basics series. If you're having trouble with Cricut Design Space in general, we probably have a video for you. Have a question about anything we've covered or a question about Cricut Design Space in general, ask it below. I'll either link you to a video that will answer your question or I might use your question for a future video right here on YouTube. So be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel so you don't miss any of the Cricut Basics series. Also, be sure to give us a thumbs up on this video if you liked it. So thank you all so much for joining me today and I'll be back next week. Thanks, bye.